This is uh, Vince Marino Plumbing LLC, Pittsburgh. Today is uh, November 17, 2022. We're going to be doing uh, a gas service riser replacement for people's gas. Service riser only. It's natural gas, not propane. And um, this is the uh, the gas kind of want to cover the address. The owner dug this up, so they're going to squeeze the line here. I faxed in the uh, SRI form to People's Gas. There's a leak here somewhere. I sprayed it. I couldn't see it. Could have been from the regulator. But the gas company shut it off. So as I make headway here, I'll have some more footage after the completion. This is the orange plastic. Now we use the yellow. But this is still approved. This was actually a perfection um, stab riser. Brought it out. They buried it too low. Okay, I'll get back to you shortly. Now this is a uh, Honeywell Max Berry. Uh, Perfection joint. Now it doesn't say 2.0. Do they still work on the uh they still work the new ones work on the orange? we're gonna put that stop on there oh jeez he uncovered it for you and didn't know the valves off son of a bitch oh my yeah church they can't get the valve off here and they're not gonna squeeze this we're in the process of doing a hookup Oh jeez, it's a shame. It's got to be one of those metal valves, it's a pl orange plastic. You guys are gonna start to get busy now. I'm always busy. And I'm I'm actually running two zones today. Two zones, man. You want me to help you? No, hang on. 
That's an old shitting valve. Well, it looks like they're not going to squeeze this. The other guy did. Okay. Huh? No, I'm a, I have them, but then okay. I'm not no, going to. No, no, no. no. What do you want to push on the top? Yeah. Let me get my glove. Definitely. Let me get my. I got a shirt. Put me. I got a shirt here. We'll just put this on. Okay. Whatever you chose, don't mess up hands. Just put that on. There he is. Almost like he knew what we were doing. Yeah. That's a Almost. Sucks. Almost. Man. You think you got it off? Yeah. Don't touch me. Okay. I got the pipe tape here. You get the. Are you a cutter, sir? Yeah. Here. You, go ahead, you do it, or I do it. Whatever you want to do. I don't want to. Yeah, yeah, no. If it's. Here. I'll help you. I mean, uh, Got it? I got that bracket. I just got to tighten it. I believe that nipple, that nipple should work for you. Thank you. All right. I don't want to throw it in the dirt. Okey doke. Don't worry, I'm not filming you. I'm filming the ditch. I filmed some of my work. I got an idea from somebody. It's, it's good for... Uh, protection well I, I have a youtube channel for my business and i thought this would be a good uh i was looking for i was looking forward to squeezing that with that reed tool but it's better to shut it off yeah i think that's stupid well that's their i'm an old equitable guy okay? yeah you look familiar you work for equitable that's what i thought you probably know andy lecce uh, yeah, He's been, is he still alive again? I haven't seen him for a long time. Yeah. Shit. There's a lot of pressure in there. Oh, really? Okay. Here, let me just set that right there. Shoes. Yeah, that's right. They used to call him, right? <laughs> that other guy, is he still alive? That Orsini? Tony Orsini? I don't know. I think, I'll be honest. They had that old bracket on there with toggle bolts. I cut them off <laughs> and drilled the new ones. And uh, oh good. Oh shit. You want your uh, persuader? No, not on the hustle. You shouldn't have too much more to go, huh? I'm leaving next year. I don't blame you, it's good. Okay, before I loosen this all the way, take a, take a look at your riser and cut, I tell you, pull that plastic up and cut that as far as you can. Here. I sort of eyeballed, this is longer than that shit and thing. Okay, cut it right here between the, the, the sleeve and the, yeah. We can always cut it again. But once you break it, I'll pull it up. That's what I'm saying, but I don't want to loosen this. That way, that's easier. If you cut that first, then I'll take a sample through the whole thing away. 
All right, let me get in there. We're gonna zap out. You all right? Yeah, I'm okay. I didn't dig this. The, the, the home, the homeowner did. Right here. Yeah. Right, right about here. I don't care, wherever your horses are. Okay. All right. All right. Hold that up. These are yours. That's an old uh, perfection, huh? Yeah, that's a that's a factory fit, I believe. Or some shit, that. Yeah, that's the old, that's the one that used to fit. Right, I told. Ready? We're not gonna use this. There's where the leak was, sink. Yeah, I ain't more care. Oh, so how are we hitting there? You have a wire. You gonna slip on you there for the? No, don't cut that wire. The ground wire? No, nope, don't cut that. Just leave it where it's at. Here. That's the you look, look here. All right. Turn that's, on the ditch. No, get the tire out of the way. I can't. I can't pull it out. It's on the. No, it's on the damn my bracket here. Oh, okay. Here. I'm sorry. That's what I was meaning to uh -oh. just trim that wire. Here. I didn't know. I didn't know what you were doing. Here. Okay, that's good. That's where it was rotted out and leaking there. Yeah, I ain't worried about that. Okay. Alright, no. no momentous. I got the uh let's take a look let's take a look at that bar. No, I don't want to see that yet. The bar? Yeah. I I eyed it up, I believe this this nipple I have in there should work if you take the other one out. Got it? Yeah. Yep, Tony Orsini. And rags. Who the hell was that? I don't Ray. know. John Organa. Yeah, that, that, that was equitable guys. Those people yeah, yeah. are either dead, retired. There was another guy. What the hell was his name? Vecchio. Vecchio. Frank. Oh, he's dead. He yeah. died, that guy. Yeah, huh? he was, yeah, he was a people. People. No, he was an equitable guy. Equitable, yeah. yeah. He used to handle Lawrenceville, Bloomfield, I believe. Frank. Buddy Frank. Yes, sir. I'm going to take this off. We're going to put this back on, okay? That's okay. Because I don't want to loosen this up and it is the end of So you don't you you don't squeeze it, you just shut them off. It depends on the situation. Yeah, this is medium. I don't think squeezing this would have been a good idea. You squeeze the plastic and all you're doing, especially when it's 20 degrees out, so we're gonna do it. Yeah, you can crack it. Great. Now, okay, you don't crack it now. But 20 years from now, five years from now, six weeks from now. You can damage it. 52. I'm, I'm 64. Like, you're oh. older than me. Yeah, just by a little bit. Okay, is that started? Yeah. All right, let's see. Hey, don't put that on yet. We're going to have to swing that in to reach the bracket. Put it on the bracket. You have something else? That's all I got. All right, hang on. I can go out to the last nut. Yeah, I'm just getting this on. I'm not gonna. Yeah, but you're, you're putting this in the way. It'll slide in. All right. Okay. Let's uh, wait till you do. Yeah, that'll straighten out. I can move it over to. Uh, I thought it was going to be on the money. No.
actually I can slide this over so we don't have to worry this this is this will slide over see the the marches it'll go over I don't know how the fuck we're gonna do this one here. further. I'm going to have to readjust this bastard. I have to, uh, I don't know what the fuck we're going to do here. Oh, I'm going fucking wash. Soap. Okay. I can be too. What's we tighten that did we tighten that up? What's uh, leaking? We didn't did we tighten that ride with that? Yeah. No. No. That's gotta be tight. You gotta shut it off in a rush here. You gotta tighten that on. Yeah, that's got that's gotta be tightened. Just uh There's a fucking jack. Yeah, that's okay. We'll tighten it up. Is it on? You can probably spin that around with the... Uh, Maybe from where you're at, easier to me. Yeah, I'll turn it up, sure. Okay. There you go. Yeah, it's a little bit loose. <laughs> I'd say. There's the wrench. So I said, you're in a hurry. You're, you're spinning your wheels here. Take a breath. Huh? You're rushing. Oh no, I don't. I yeah, check. but no, no. I see what you're doing, and, and that's time. yeah. No, no. See, then you're then you're fucking up. And yeah, you don't want to be messing. Yeah, then I'm messing up too. Then messing yeah. up with stuff like this. Yeah, right. No, no.
Now let me turn the key on. Now we'll do the right thing on that side. Yeah, I think we'll be okay. Yeah, I think it's gonna be okay now. This is a gas service line replacement, as you can see. Go ahead, set your meter. I'm gonna. I gotta redraw another hole for this son of a gun. I gotta just move it up. I wanted to get this on because I didn't know. Because I, I can't. Um, I had a paint strike when it's this cold. <laughs> uh, yeah. I got here at 10 o'clock. When did you call this in? I called in at, at about 11.30. I just called it about 20 minutes ago. I faxed it in. And I called it about 20 minutes ago. She called me at around 12 and said somebody's going to be there. Yeah, right. Yeah, I'm telling you the truth. No, I'm just saying, yeah, right, someone's going to be there. Yeah, no, no, I ain't busting your balls. Where the hell does that, where does that come out of? Uh, Pittsburgh or? The 1 800 number. They give me the 15 minute call. Eh? I did. Oh, that was you? Yeah. But you came within five minutes. Well, I, I hear know. something now. Yeah, because the regulator's Oh, okay. It's bleeding. Yeah. What is this? Medium? But. About five PSI? No, it's probably about 30, 50. I ain't sure some of people's stuff is a little bit. 30 PSI before the minute. Huh? Well, this regulator's put up to 60 pounds. Uh -huh. And then you gotta have a two stage cut. I see. Okay. I'll blame it on me for that. That's okay, things happen. Yeah, I'm okay. okay, okay. No more, no more so screwing up, huh? Nah. Just get the fuck out of here. Yeah, I'll figure them more till I'm out of here. It's a fucking thing gotta go in, huh? Seven. Seven, three, four, nine. I think it'll reach. Yeah, it won't. Up the swing turn at 90 and. Well, I'm gonna do something because I gotta put that bracket. I, am. I have other fittings, I guess. Uh, I'll shut this off and. Uh, Why? Don't shut it off. Well, how am I gonna move the? Uh, the what do you want to do? Can't we? Uh, what do you want to do? I want to reach the bracket. There you go, right there. Just, just there's the right there. <sighs> Let me see. Yeah, I think it will. No, we don't have to do it. That's Thank right. You. This is on a slope, this damn thing, huh? Yeah, I just made it. Well, I'll do this. Do it the best I can. Good thing that damn valve shut off, huh? huh? I said good good thing that that valve. Not on medium pressure.
Yeah, what the hell are you gonna do? I gotta draw another hole in the night. As you can see, this almost turned into a disaster. I gotta draw another hole here. The gas guy was in a rush, maybe. I'll have some more footage shortly. All right, I'm gonna reposition this anchor. As you can see, the gas man did this. Uh, needed a longer nipple, but he didn't want to change it. If it gets in there. and tap it bastard in. We got these lead anchors we use here in Pittsburgh. This is a medium pressure set. If you heard them on the video, it's 30 pounds before here. in here this is an adjustable bracket it's good so we're gonna tighten this sucker on Yeah, yeah, I'm good. Okay. Have a happy re... Vince Marino.
I, I don't I could imagine I could imagine okay have a nice uh, Thanksgiving what what's your name again Bob, Bob yeah okay See, they hooked the, he did the meter, not me, you know. Uh -uh. Is that the owner? Oh, it's you. I'll show you where the leak was if you want to show it. Sure. It rotted out. See, we, we shut it off. He shut it off at the curb like I told you. The guy in the summer, they squeezed it. It's cold right now. And uh, if you squeeze it, you can uh, damage the pipe and crack it. This is a medium, medium pressure set. You don't want to be uh, squeezing the, the, the old plastic that's been buried. It can make problems down the road. Now, when your son-in-law backfills, I want sand in here. Okay. Dump a uh, two uh, get four or five buckets of sand. Put it right in the back of this. You want support back here. You understand? Yeah, I got you. Because uh, I'm uh, responsible for this. I want to see and, and have your uh, daughter-in-law send me pictures of the sand. I'm tightening the. Uh, Hello, can I help you? Yeah, hi. Uh, my name's Nicole, and I'm actually calling from a company called um, Acero Services. We handle homes that are in, like, foreclosure. You know what, um, uh, Miss? I'm too busy. I don't do any work for uh, maintenance or whatever facilities anymore. You don't do one of your on no. properties? No. Okay, thanks. Thanks. Okay. This is tight. That's tight. It's still tight. We're tightening this up nice. And uh, you're going to be good to go. You're back and you have hot water, right? Okay, and this is uh, Vince Marino, Plumbing LLC in Pittsburgh. Dot certified if you have a... If you have a... 
gas leak, gas service leak, or whatever. I can do it for you. I can do it for you, not we. Not we. I have somebody to help me, but uh, in the meantime, until the next adventure here, let me show you this uh, riser where it leaked. Okay. This was the orange plastic. I'll see you later, thanks. They give them 10 days to fix this line. So, this is where the uh, the riser brought it out. You can see there, there's actually a leak on the valve, but it rotted it out. This is an old uh, perfection pre bent riser. So the plastic's still good, but uh, the uh, riser rotted out. Okay. Until the next adventure. This is uh, Vince Marino Plumbing LLC in Pittsburgh. Ciao.